The success story of Tumblr founder David Karp. Most of the successful people have some point of view regarding formal education. Many of them left school and refused school and chose to teach himself personally in the field he had passion for, which is what David Karp did, who decided to leave school at the age of 15, amid strict rejection and objections from parents. But he did what he saw fit him. To this day, David Karp has not completed his studies and has not attended university. David taught himself programming and design from scratch and mastered programming at the age of 14. In his teens, the boy managed to develop several programs and sell them to local companies. David later found a job at Frederator Studios. At the age of 17, David completed a huge project in a few days and acquired a part of it and sold it to CNET, after which he used the money to build his own software company and started taking projects and working for individuals and companies. After the company settled, David also worked on Tumblr while working for the company. In early 2007, he launched Tumblr, a blogging platform, which was very popular at the time. Just two weeks after launching the platform, the number of users reached 75,000, setting a world record. Short term. David threw himself into his new project and started providing a platform for investors and got a large funding round that helped him achieve great success, and after a few years the profits reached more than $200 million and the number of blogs was only in the first half of 2013, more than 108 million blogs were created. Finally, in mid-2013, Yahoo bought the platform for $1.1 billion, one of the biggest deals of the year, while David Karp remained the platform's CEO.